Welcome to another vlog. I wanted to start this one out today because I have a feeling that if I check my bank account this morning, I will have a fun little surprise, which is what I'm doing right now. And it's in. You guys, I just got my first YouTube paycheck. I'm so, so excited. That's like such a goal that I've been waiting for. So because I know people get curious about this and I honestly like I don't mind, I'll go ahead and share them out with you guys. For part of May through June, I made $136.74. So I didn't get paid earlier because I didn't hit the minimum threshold to get paid out. And that's because for me, monetization hit about a week into May. Basically just a crash course for anyone who's not familiar with how YouTubers get paid out and stuff. Basically you get paid out monthly. So if you're smaller on YouTube and your payment doesn't hit that $100 threshold, within the month like mine did because I lost a week in May where I could have made that then that amount rolls over to the next month until you hit the hundred dollar threshold then you get cashed out for the whole thing so I had to wait for my June payments to catch up and fill in that gap but I am so excited it definitely feels like an accomplishment to like see that I got paid by YouTube right now like something that I only dreamed would ever happen to me so very very excited and I know exactly what I'm saving that first paycheck for if you guys have been around you know that like the OG beauty youtubers were like my inspiration for just Jumping onto YouTube and stuff, in particular my favorite is Nicole Guerrero, but another favorite of mine is Desi Perkins, who you guys know she's been on this like amazing fertility journey. She's finally pregnant after years of trying, and she's a freaking boss because throughout her pregnancy she's also been starting her own brand. This week she is about to launch Desi Sunglasses, so I'm saving my first YouTube paycheck to support one of my OG YouTubers who inspired me to start my own channel. So I thought that that was pretty appropriate and I'm really excited about the brand. I have three sunglasses that I have my eye on. I'm trying to narrow it down to just two. I think I know which two I'm gonna get, but of course I have a feeling that the two that I want are probably gonna be the most popular ones, so this is gonna be like a crazy launch. I'm hoping that she has enough in stock that it's not like everything will sell out within like the first minute, but I do plan on being like on the website literally right at 9 a.m. And I will do a review video on those sunglasses as well, but Mm, that's good. Seriously guys, the milk frother was the best kitchen appliance that we've invested in for sure. But I'm gonna go ahead and get to work and also squeeze a workout in at some point of the day, but I'll probably talk to you guys a little bit later tonight. Okay, so we are putting a shelf up. We got this like a few weeks ago and we finally got the brackets for it, so we're putting it right above here. Just above where people sit, not like too low, because obviously we don't want people to hit their head, but... Yeah, about there. Yeah, that's so odd. Oh my god, you guys, it feels so good to see the outside world right now. You don't even know. I have been so deep in data entry all day long. I'm like going cross-eyed. My coordinator's out of the office, so right now I'm doing the job of two people <laughs> at the moment, and I'm just like, I need to get out. And I got an alert that a little order that I placed is ready for pickup, so I'm gonna go get it. I ordered a little something fun for our upcoming trip. We're going on a trip next week. I know I've teased it a little bit, but just a little bit more info. It is happening next week. And I ordered something that I've always wanted 
and I'm finally getting, so um, I'm gonna go pick it up. I know that I'm being very cryptic, but you guys are literally gonna see it in like a minute here. So that's why I'm like creating the suspense because it's not gonna be that long. But yeah, so about the trip, we are gonna be flying, which does make us both a little bit, I don't wanna say nervous. We're not like super nervous about flying, but we're very cautious about flying. So, you know, we've been researching, you know, anything that we need to bring, anything that we just like need to know as far as like new protocols or just like things to be aware of. It is gonna be a very short flight though. So that's also why we're willing to fly. Truthfully, we're actually gonna go visit some family. So we were leaning flying anyways instead of driving just because we wanted to maximize the family time. So super excited. If you guys really wanna get a jump on info on where we're going, then make sure you're following me on Instagram because I will be updating the trip in real time. So if you'd like to cheat and find out where we're going ahead of time, then make sure you're following me on there. But I am nearing the pickup place, so I will see you guys in just a minute. Okay, I've just arrived at the curbside pickup. I put on my mask just to be like respectful because I know that they're bringing stuff out to me. So just so that, you know, everyone's more comfortable. So I guess I have to just like check in. Okay, and then you just check in and give them your slot number. And uh, I guess I will chill here and wait for them to bring my package out to me. Oh, yes. Perfect. Do you want me to just put it in the passenger seat for you? Yes, that's fine. Perfect. You Thank you so set. much. Have Appreciate it. Cool. So I am all set here. Time to head out. I think I'm going to stop by the grocery store, grab a couple of things that I ran out of, and I'll show you guys what I got in a second here as soon as we get to a red light, which apparently is right now. So that is perfect. Good timing. So. Like I said, always wanted one of these. Finally got one. I got one of the little Fujifilm Insta, what is this? Instax minis. So this is their newest one, I guess. This is the number 11 and I got it in this really, really cute blue because it's like aesthetic for my feed. I don't know if you guys have noticed, I tend to have like some pops of blue in my feed just because I'm very, very big into the fact that I live in Southern California. So I like posting bright blue skies, the ocean, stuff like that as some like filler images lately. So I figured that the blue would be a nice choice since I do plan to use it as a prop sometimes in my photos. So super, super excited to finally have one. But like I said, I'm gonna stop at the grocery store and then I'll fully unbox this and set it up when I get home. Okay, so back home, animals have been fed, but I realized I had another unboxing. Oh, where'd it go? Another thing that I ordered that I wanna show you guys. Oh, there it is. But before I left, I impacted this. This is the Mio Diamond Microabrasion and Pore Extracting Skin Resurfacing System. So I just happened to see this and I've always wanted to try a microdermabrasion kind of system. So I thought I'd go ahead and order this. This was actually fairly inexpensive, so I was surprised. This is supposed to help with the appearance of dry patches, which I don't have, but all the other things on this list I am down for help with. Um, fine lines and wrinkles, pore size, age spots, although that's another one that I don't have. I don't really have age spots yet. But it helps with firmness, blackheads, whiteheads, and acne scarring. So this is supposed to help with a ton of things. So I'm gonna use this for four weeks and give you guys a review, like a before and after on what my skin looks like. That'll be its own separate video, but yeah, I just got this in today. But for the camera, which I am, like I can't even tell you guys how excited I am about this. I almost ordered like, it's gonna sound crazy. 12 of these for our wedding. I wanted to put one of these at every single table, then like auction them off at the end, and then just like get to keep all of the Polaroids, but that didn't end up happening. It was very, very expensive to do that. So I'm finally just getting one for myself, and oh my God, she is so freaking cute. Like seriously, that is just like adorable. Oh, the eye is on this side. Ah! I cannot wait to use this. I'm so, so freaking excited. So it comes with a guide. It comes with a little wrist strap. Ooh, very nice of them to provide batteries. And then it also comes with these. What are these? These are like little knobs or something for it. I have no idea, but I don't have the film yet. It didn't come with film and I was gonna buy it from Urban Outfitters, but I found it for much cheaper on Amazon. So I'm just gonna order it. It'll probably be a couple of days before I get it, but cute love it very 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 stoked about this and then i figured i might as well do a very 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 mini grocery haul for you because you know what 
why not? So first off, I got my favorite Caesar salad kit. This is the Taylor Farms chopped kit. I love this one because the lettuce is shredded. I've talked about this so many times, but it's so good. And then also you guys can see here, the croutons are like these crouton crumbles. Seriously, such a good salad. It's just so smooth because everything's like so finely shredded or crumbled or whatever. So I had to get a refill of this. We have a bunch of leftover lasagna. If you watched the last vlog, you saw Trevor made lasagna for us. So I'm slowly eating my way through that, but I don't want to eat too much lasagna every night. So I do a big salad, then a small slice of lasagna to go with it. And then I also got a little refill of the snack pea crisps and then some dried parsley flakes. We go through dried parsley so quickly in this household and we needed a refill. Also got some carrot sticks. I am obsessed with dipping carrot sticks in bitchin' sauce. It's so, so freaking good, you guys. Honestly, I'm gonna be bold and say it. It's just as good as eating chips. Dipping these in bitchin' sauce, just as good of a snack as chips, and you guys know. Chips are like my favorite thing ever. But like seriously, so good. I went through the carrots that I bought last week so fast because I cannot stop snacking on this. So had to get more. Also got some extra firm tofu, just like for some quick dinners. And then I am dying to try this. I got some GT's kombucha, but this is the classic one. This is the divine grape. And this is the kind that actually has a little bit of alcohol in it from the fermentation. I'm sure many of you guys know when you ferment something, it naturally just becomes alcoholic. Most kombuchas take the alcohol out, but GT's obviously does have a line that does still contain some alcohol. So you even have to be 21 plus to purchase this, but I'm trying to find how much alcohol Okay, so it has 0.5% alcohol, not anything high, not anything to get you fully trashed. But I am very, very, very interested to try this. In fact, I think I'm going to crack it open. Okay, here we go. This is like my new little fancy glass that I got from Target last week. I wonder if like I'm actually going to feel anything with this, but doesn't smell anything stronger than regular kombucha though this one does smell like Dimatap which I am here for this is the grape flavor and it like literally smells like Dimatap like I'm so into it but let's go ahead and give it a try it tastes like Dimatap which I love I'm so happy about that but they also have this in a ginger berry flavor and then a straight ginger flavor if you don't like grape but I don't know we'll see if this actually has any effect a little bit later on because I think I'm gonna go ahead and finish the bottle because you know why not okay hi having the second half of this bottle and uh yeah you can feel this <laughs> so if you'd like I guess a healthier alternative to alcohol just to like unwind this is not gonna get you trash but it's gonna give you like a nice very, very light buzz. You'll feel it, but it's not like you're trashed. This is definitely a good choice. So I like it. I'm enjoying this. So yeah, I recommend if you've ever been curious about the full alcohol kombuchas, they actually do give you a little bit of an effect. Okay, you guys, happy Thursday. I just wanted to pop on really quickly today because I got two exciting packages that I wanted to share with you guys. The first one is a PR package that I've clearly already unboxed. I did it for Instagram, so if you're following me on there, you already saw this. But I just got this in from Pixie. This is their Escape and Let's Glow collection. So in here, I have a palette that fell out, but this is this really pretty, like, bronzy, rosy palette. All of these powders in here are multi-use powders, so you can use them for blush, for bronze, eyeshadow highlighter you can kind of just like wear them however you want and then we also have their lip lift max in here and this one is in the color sweet nectar and I'm very very interested in this one so here is what it looks like in the tube really really pretty color and let's go ahead and swatch it ooh that's nice so it's pretty sheer it probably gives just like the slightest wash of color and actually let's go ahead and put it on cute i like it so that is the first one then they also sent me their large lash mascara i've never tried their mascara before so i'm very very interested to try this if i could get it open there we go should i try this right now i'm thinking that like might as well but here's the package for it very very typical pixie i don't have my curler down here so i feel like i'm not giving it fair due but let's go ahead and do a couple of coats really quick I'm sure I could tell more if my lashes were curled, but from what I'm seeing on the screen, they look good for no lash curler. I mean, they are definitely thicker. I don't think that this is really 
much of a lengthening mascara so I'm not seeing much of that going on but they are definitely thicker so that is their large lash mascara and let me double check on this is this so it's supposed to give just more of a natural look but this is not waterproof so I'm probably gonna take this off right away just because I just like I don't like to wear non-waterproof mascaras very often. And then next is their Endless Shade Stick. They sent me two of these. This first one is the Matte Cocoa. So here is what that color looks like. And then just like a nice matte, kind of more cool brown. So that'll be great like when I'm doing just a quick makeup look with my eyes. And then the other one is in Copper Glaze. So this one's more of a shimmer. Ooh, that one's pretty. I had already swatched the brown one, but the um, this is my first time seeing the copper one, and that is really, really pretty. I actually really want to use that sometime soon. And then the last thing in this PR box is my favorite part. They sent me a little tote. It's so cute. So it's their signature, kind of like light green with these pink handles and like the detail on this. Like there's like these little leather tracks on the straps so that they feel more comfortable. And they embroidered our name into it. And then inside it does have like a zipper so you can zip it closed. This is just going to be like a really, really good like extra beach bag or like when I go to the grocery store this would be great to bring as well so I love this tote I will definitely be using it a ton and then the next package is what I was most excited about I ordered this from my friend shop she is lifestyle shorty on Instagram and her Etsy shop is the gray shop and she has been making these like custom bleach dye pieces oh and here you go you guys here is like her logo and the name of the shop. I will link the shop down below if you guys are interested in it. So this is so sweet. So she hand packs all of this. Oh my God, I love like the little stickers and everything. She really like put it all together. She sent extra goodies. <gasps> I was literally about to order the sweatshirt of this as well, which I'm still going to do. This is her new cotton candy pattern, and like I fell in love. She does this in a sweatshirt too, which I really, really want, but I'm so excited for the matching t-shirt. This is so cute. So basically, you can like pick the kind of pattern that you want. You can pick whether you want a butterfly. She does like a small one or a big one, and then you can also pick the crop on it. So you can do no crop, you can do like a medium crop, or you can do an extra crop. So thank you so much, Danny. I'm so excited about this. She also sent like this matching scrunchie for it and she also sent the matching socks too you guys these like tie-dyed Nike socks oh my god this is like too much I can't um but here is the piece that I actually ordered so I got the extra crop in the sweatshirt and I'm just like obsessed with this bleach dye pattern and then I customized mine to do the brown monarch just a small one but love I want to like wear this right now but it's actually kind of hot so tonight I'll put it on tonight and I'll show you guys but so cute and then she also sent me the matching scrunchie for this one I'm obsessed I'm like seriously so excited so thank you Danny for sending me extra stuff and congrats on your shop okay so I just wanted to do a quick little try on of both of these pieces from the gray shop so here is the t-shirt so cute guys this freaking dye pattern is just so cute i'm obsessed oh my god this is gonna be like such a good like comfy at home kind of like a t-shirt like this looks really cute with these boohoo shorts love it and then i don't want to take my hair out of the claw clip but there's the scrunchie and then oh my god these socks are so cute i don't know how i'm gonna do this this camera's sitting so high up okay so i'm gonna need 20 years of dance experience to get my leg up for this here it is so oh my god falling there we go. Oh my god. One more time. Oh my gosh. So freaking cute. Falling. Okay, then here is the sweatshirt, which I'm excited about. This is the piece that I actually ordered. Cute! Oh my god. I love this. So cozy, too. Like, it's still, like, nice and soft inside, but... Ah! Oh, so fun. So obsessed with this. I wish it was colder right now so that I could wear this, but... Love it super cute again i'll have her etsy store linked below it's the gray shop you can follow her on instagram you can follow the shop on instagram basically just like super easy to find so make sure to check her out good morning you guys so a few things have happened since i've woken up i actually woke up kind of early today because i had a client meeting but right after the client meeting the desi perkins sunglasses launched and i snagged all three pairs that I was hoping to get and I will be doing a review and try on so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss it. I'm also gonna do a fun twist to my try on 
inspired by Katie's try on video. If you guys haven't seen it, I will link it below. Huge clue as to what the twist will be if you guys care to check it out and spoil it. But I also just received a package right now. My cousin texted me to tell me that I had a package coming to keep an eye out for it. So I thought I'd go ahead and unbox it here on my vlog. Aww cute little box. It says SARS on the front. All of my cousins on that side of the family call me SARS. Oh, you guys. <laughs> Yay. Oh, I'm like gonna cry. <laughs> oh my god. This is so cute. So she made like little bags with our pictures on it. She did ask me for a picture, so I was wondering. Oh my God, and then everybody is on the back here, her entire bride tribe. How freaking cute. Ooh, she sent some sugarfina, some champagne bubbles, a chapstick. Ooh, yes, you can always use chapstick. Oh my God, how cute. These little hair ties. A little compact with our name on it. So cute. It says December 2021 because that's when the wedding is. Oh my god. This is so her. This like bougie pen. I love it. Oh my god. So freaking cute. Oops. Ah! And then her wedding is in Mexico. So she sent everybody a passport holder. How fun. Oh my god. I'm so excited. I'm going to call her. She might be at work, but I'm going to try calling her. Oh, hi, Trevor. <laughs> I'm going to be a bridesmaid. I figured that's what it was. That's awesome. Hey, I just got my package. Of course I'll be your bridesmaid. Yeah. <laughs> well, I might be going to Tokyo for the bachelorette. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but excited. Thank you, Jill, because I know she watches my vlog sometimes. So I'm excited. it's another shoot day and we are being extra today uh we're extra so extra <laughs> <laughs> we have a couple of outfits that we're gonna shoot on land and then <laughs> i know two by land two by sea <laughs> <laughs> and then trevor's gonna come meet up with us because we rented a boat and he is gonna be our captain and <laughs> we're gonna take pictures on a boat because you know why not why not <laughs> why <laughs> and Trevor doesn't know yet, but I actually got him a little captain's hat, so <laughs> kind of which we're very excited about. <laughs> I can't wait to see his reaction. I know it's gonna be so good. This is gonna be hilarious. Do you think that he'll is he the type of person who would just willingly do it? Or oh yeah, no, he'll wear it. He's gonna think it's funny. Yes, <laughs> I'm this so is great. excited. I hope you can drive the boat. I know. If well, not, I, I was gonna I say you know how. how to. So we got a power boat. We didn't get a Duffy boat this time. Oh, why am I saying this time? This is the first time that we bought a boat. This time we get boats every weekend. <laughs> right? um, no, we got the power boat just that way. It doesn't have like the top, Money. and we can. It's brighter. But Trevor's never driven a power boat. Apparently, it's very easy to do, which is why they just let you rent one. But we have an experienced power boater. I've never driven right a power boat though, like. I was driving ocean. a lake, so I've never done like an ocean, and I don't so know like <laughs> if that boat's gonna be different in any way. Cause like we have a ski mm. boat, and I know boats can oh. be different, like temperamental. So I don't know if they have like a speed limit on the boat. I I'm sure it's like five. I'm you sure know. it's like no way. Are we gonna be sloshing around? Um. Um, also, I have a dress, <laughs> and I'm a little worried about the wind. <laughs> I didn't even think it's about that. It's a short dress. <laughs> See, you should have brought your bikini bottoms. I brought um, Spanx shorts. Oh, well, there so, you go. It's just you and Trevor on the boat. No one yeah, else is that's all fine. And it's shorts. Yeah. So I feel like, oh, those girls look cute, and they're for sure taking pictures. See, other people are doing it. Yeah, we're a little bit concerned because, like, there's a, like, new development where it's, like, you'll get, or they can find you if you are not wearing your mask in public, but like, we're like, well, we're going to secluded areas to shoot. I didn't even and think obviously about- Obviously we don't want a mask. I didn't even think about you, yeah, I was like, I didn't even think about like taking pictures. Go ahead, people. My breaks sound awful. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. 
<gasps> oh, that baby's cute. Aww. She's having a little. Oh, Kaylee. I'm... I want to be carried. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I just want to be carried everywhere I go, like a child. You know what? Me too. <laughs> I didn't need an assistant. I wear <laughs> an assistant to carry us <laughs> and our stuff. Honestly, just get like a wagon and carry all our stuff with us in the and wagon. And pull us in the wagon. Yeah. Oh, I would love that. that sounds wonderful. That would be so great. Tra traffic has tried died down. Right yeah, now. it's actually not that bad over here. We were worried no, about no. parking as well. Yeah, this is why car. I hate driving down here. Gosh. Everyone just like runs out onto That's the street. Really it's very annoying. But okay, we will show you guys where we're at in the next clip. Two hours later. So after 48 minutes of searching for parking, we've given up. <laughs> that was a long haul. It's I mean, so packed today, and we've shot here in, in, in the summertime before and it was not this crazy like I think it's just we were saying like we think it's just because like there's nothing else to do besides like go to the beach right now so that's where everyone is heading like right even now. like the patches of grass in between parking lots have yeah. people on it so we're gonna go shoot more inland and then just uber back here for the boat because i mean we have to come back for the boat we don't, yeah. we don't have a choice we, we are yeah. way past being able to cancel without yeah <laughs> any penalty so we're yeah we're just gonna we're gonna uber shoot back. as fast as possible yeah we can do it it's only three outfits it's only three honestly outfits. i think we'll be able to do all three honestly i just need some white walls yeah and we're going somewhere where there's like a ton of white walls yeah. so we'll be good we'll be easy fine. it's yeah. cool i mean we can do one in the parking lot one in one of the white walls. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be good. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Okay, so Michelle is changing into her first look right now. I'm just like finishing up my hair for this. Um, but the plan is now, we're probably about three miles away from the beach. So Trevor's gonna come meet us here. And the little center that we're at has a yard house. So we're gonna order food to go, have Trevor meet us here. Uber back to that area so that we can get on our boat. So, okay, cute. It's my outfit. I have a little halter, black halter top on from Forever 21. My Adidas biker shorts and then my Spurgas. And then my Villasiva sunglasses. So, um, once she's done, we're gonna start taking some pictures. Okay, so we just finished shooting our land looks and now we're gonna go pick up some yard house to take it to go to take on the boat so we can eat on the boat. So we're just moving Michelle's car so okay. it doesn't look so obvious that we just like parked here then like, jet, yeah, just like jet it off. Okay, so Trevor is driving us right now and we got him a little present, which I will give him in a second. Okay, we're going this way. So, thanks for driving us. Oh. Woo! Captain! <laughs> captain! <laughs> He's a captain! <laughs> I'm like, don't blow it off. <laughs> there you go, that's a good one. So, we are on the boat now. Obviously, you guys just saw me give Trevor his little captain's hat. But, oh my god, it's so dark this direction. But Michelle and I are literally like in the same freaking swimsuit. <laughs> They're not the exact same, different material, but like same color, same kind of cut. Like, literally same like, color. <laughs> like same cut, completely. Like it's totally the same. Not on purpose, I promise. Not on purpose. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna go shoot some pictures. Can you shoot a bike club? Okay, not entirely sure how well you guys can hear me, but we are gonna dig into our food. I got some truffle fries. Michelle got a chocolate cake. <laughs> also some uh, boneless oh lemon pepper wings. And then Trevor has some um, chicken tenders down on the bottom.
is Sunday and we are going to do a fun Sunday outing today. Believe it or not, Trevor has never been to Rodeo Drive, so we're going to go today. But before we get started on that, one second, can we please like take a second to appreciate these lashes? Like, oh my god, they're so long. Um, I feel like they've grown even more since I did my Grande Lash review. But we're really excited to take him. I just wish that I could like buy something designer while I was down there, but it's all good. I've been waiting all my life for something. I've been down the darkest roads and up in the clouds. But I've always felt that something's missing. That was until I found you right there in the crowd. You came into my life and started. time to come here. We've got this amazing table just overlooking the street here. Again, wouldn't normally be able to get this when it's normally busy, so good choice to come here at this time, Trevor. Um, but right we now, got lucky. we did get lucky. But we're being fancy and acting like, you know, we actually belong. We ordered aquapana for our water. We got cocktails, appetizers. We're gonna go all out on this lunch. Like a perfect melody. Baby, don't back home and just chilling. Trevor is upstairs napping because he needs to go to work soon and I think I'm gonna go ahead and just end the vlog here just because I'm just going to Trader Joe's and Target later which like you guys have seen me do a million times so definitely don't feel the need to keep vlogging but I am going to prep for our vacation which will be the next vlog coming up so make sure that you are subscribed stay tuned I know you guys don't know where we're going yet that is on purpose I will have a mystery vacation haul that'll be going up some point this week so you guys can try to guess based on the clothes and accessories that I bought where we're going and then a week from today will be the official vacation vlog we are very excited about it the details on it just keep getting better and better and better so can't wait to share that with you guys and I love you and I'll see you guys very soon in the next one. Bye.